Let's start with the guy who's wanted for the murder charge. Bring him in. LAPD, Varley! Stop or I'll shoot! Come on, Varley! You can't keep running forever! You're the same Reginald Varley the Detroit police have an outstanding warrant on. How am I doing so far? I need a lawyer before I talk to any of you. Reginald Varley, you're under arrest for committing a series of arsons. You're also under arrest for murder. Detroit PD will be putting in a request for your extradition. Until then, your guest is... Arson? You, you can't hang that rap on me. Be quiet. Be thankful we don't shoot you. Are all the cops in this town crazy? I'll take him away, officer. They can make a claim to the apartment. We want some answers and we want them quick. 
Okay, okay. What's this all about? Just tell me what you want. You know Reginald Barley? No. Can't say I do. Detroit PD is after Reginald Barley for murder. We want us to run you in for aiding and abetting Clemens. Whoa, 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 whoa. All I know about Varley is he gets kickbacks from some developer. He does their work first. He spreads it around if he can. You were licensed and worked for Instaheat? I contract for them. So what? Instaheat hires arsonists, does it? I've worked as a fitter all my life. Put everything I had into that house. And my fucking mud shark of a wife gets awarded it in the settlement. She's blowing spicks two at a time while I'm at work. And she gets the house. Yeah, I burnt it all right. Set fire to that fucker and watch it burn to the ground. I did my time and I'd do it again. Sorry about the rouse, Clemens. You did the right thing. Do you know Matthew Ryan? No. Don't know the name. His locker is right next to yours. Give it up. Okay, so I know Ryan. All right, Clemens. You're off the hook for the moment. Can I get back to work now? Let's get out of here, Phelps. He ain't our guy. Are you Matthew Ryan? Who's asking? Detective Phelps and Biggs, arson squad. Arson? You heard the man. I'll just put this stuff in the car and I'll be right with you. Hold it, Ryan. I said, son of a bitch. <laughs> Those are GIs back. Give it up, LAPD. Well, that was shorter than expected. Why did you run, Ryan? I was scared. You got a reason to be scared, Ryan? Matthew Ryan, I'm arresting you on suspicion of committing a series of arsons. suspects. As much as I'd like it to be, Chapman, I think it's one of the other two guys. Let's get to the station and close this case. Jesus Christ. 
Notify the coroner's office. It's not often you get them this easy. The driver left his car behind and hoofed it. Any witnesses? None of them saw the crash, but by the blood, I'd say the driver can't be too far. Did anyone see where the driver went? I saw a guy run up that alley. He's hiding around here somewhere, I know it. Just stay away from me, goddammit! I mean it! Get back! You can't! Partner! I think we got our guy. <laughs> then just stand there, do something then. Damn bum! Come on, hit me. Okay, you did hit me. Sleep for a second. I've never had any trouble like this before, officer. Never William ever. William Shelton. Oh Christ! It's you. Look, you gotta believe me. I'm no criminal. I was just trying to string it out a bit. Honest. I have two suspects. Phelps, you got nothing. Biggs, Ryan's waiting for you in interview one. Farley's in two. Hey, Hopkins, you practicing your asshole routine again? Come on, Phelps. Charging suspect will close the case. Yeah, let's just give it to anyone. Save yourself some time and get this thing off your chest. <laughs> if that's your opening gambit, you better try again. Now you got nothing to say? Well, I'm not done! So, uh, competition ticket. Regulator valve. Matthew Ryan.
You know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. Hmm. He's not telling the truth. I don't think... believe that, Ryan. I could do it myself. Believe whatever you want, Flatfoot. You're part of the conspiracy. God damn it. Hmm. Can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. Campaign Clements Reginald Valley. But this isn't Reginald Valley, is it? Have we got anything to prove? Contempt and assault. He's got. I haven't got anything solid on him. I think Suburban is a front for your anarchist buddies. They're arranging for people to be out of town while you burn their houses down. Suburban? What's that got to do with me? That's Farley's bilk. He's the one with the cozy agreement with those fascists. Okay. So you want to change the world, Ryan? Yes, I do. So does every reasonable person. And you're doing your part? Yes, I am. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about. Hmm. Is that enough? Let's see. This is industrial sabotage, Ryan. It's all part of your campaign. You're delusional, detective. What campaign? So you know just what I'm thinking, as well as what I'm God supposed to have done. Give me a break. You have a history of violence. I have no such thing. Okay, that is a lie. You're lying, Ryan. And how exactly are you going to prove that? You were charged with attempted murder, Ryan. It was a court case. No criminal liability was the verdict. They said that they couldn't have known that the faulty heater installation would cause a fire. All I know is I lost my whole family. And the company that was responsible got away with it. What would you do? Which company? Asbestos Water Heater Company. That's it for the moment, Ryan. So I can go? Sure. As soon as your red friends storm the building and carry you out, you'll keep your seat until we decide how long to lock you up for, knucklehead. Come to California to be a secretary. I think Ryan is our man. But procedure says we eliminate all of the suspects. Let's speak to Varley. 
Oh, Susie, you are so bad. <laughs> ah, shut up. All right, let's do the coroner says it's gonna be at least a week to get a night. Where's the other one? Place the two, two. Two. Oh, and boy, this get way. Going. I say we bust in there and find the goddamn evidence. Hey, Vinny, how's it going? I mean, you know you made it if you got We have point. Matthew Ryan in custody, Barley. I think all we need to do is ask him about this, and he'll write you out. Fuck Ryan, that pinko bastard. Hey. Have you ever worked on a place on Rosewood Avenue? Family by the name of Sawyer? Maybe. I, I'm from out of town. I go where they send me. I, I, I don't do a lot of repairs, though. I'm flat out on new installations. Why are you lying to me, Barley? If Suburban wants their new installations completed, why are you bothering with Rex like the Sawyer house? So I'm lying just because I can't remember if I was there or not? How can you prove that I was? Your name is on the inside door of their water heater. Okay. You got me there. You're damn right, I got Suburban. you. Yeah, they wanted that guy out. Sawyer kept complaining about not being able to get his heater service, so they threw in a free service as a sweetener. I think you played him, though. Because he still wouldn't sell. Word is, you're in the pocket of some property developer? <laughs> Never. I got principles. Okay. How did Suburban get a squeeze on you? Did they find out about your record? There's no way you can link me to Suburban. You're wasting your time. I've got two things. Gas fit and Matthew Ryan testifies to Volley conspiring with Suburban. Let's go with this one. Brian says you offered to cut him in on the kickbacks they were offering. I'll testify in court. Suburban, they got real time pressure on getting some of the big developments finished. There's some big date that they can't afford to miss. So yeah, I took their money, but so did a lot of guys, all right? Carpenters, electricians, plumbers. It's no big conspiracy. What would reversing the diaphragm of an Instaheat Model 70 do? Yeah, I made that mistake before. You get a big bang when you turn the pilot back on. So you didn't deliberately sabotage the water heater at the Sawyer house? No, I did not. You out of your mind? Again, I don't believe you, lying. Harley. I think Suburban wants homeowners who don't want to sell out of the way. I think you're out of your mind. Where is the evidence that I have done anything to contribute to this fire? Huh? You're saying I'm some kind of psycho for hire? Shh. It's not Shiza. true. Reginald Barley, I'm charging you with committing a series of arsons and for the murders of Hank Sawyer, Edwina Sawyer, Henry Sawyer, and Jessica Sawyer. I'm no cold-blooded criminal. I could never burn up a whole family in their home. Eesh. I think I got the wrong guy. How is it? No, just keep your mouth shut and listen to me for a second. How is it you can bring no less than three suspects into my station, conduct extensive interviews, sift through mountains of evidence with Lynch and Pinker, and still manage to charge the wrong fucking guy? I took a chance on you, Phelps. People said I was crazy, and you made me look like a jerk. 
You may not be much of an arson investigator, but I hear you're merciless on the beat. Get going. Well... Sh shite. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think I had enough on him, but whatever. Yeah, see you later, Vinny. You're two blocks behind first and second. We have more buildings to clear. You know our orders, There's Sergeant. There's barely a building left standing or not on fire in your zone, Cole. Is your sector full of Japs? Questioning my command. The captain doesn't want anyone falling behind. Tell the captain we will join him when the job is done. Just give us the word, Sarge. We'll take care of him. He should be sectioned. That Jap lover's a fucking liability. We're here to kill Japs, not our own people. Starcross, son of a bitch. No one wants to serve under him. He's bad fucking luck. Can it? We have a job to do here. If I can live with it, you can too. <laughs> 